Every life is a, a story, <clears throat> and in each life there are teachings. Towards the end of the uh, report of the Aboriginal Justice Inquiry's examination of the murder of Helen Betty Osborne, we observed that the tragedy of her death would not be in her dying or the way that she was murdered, but the tragedy would be if, if we forgot her, if we did not remember what she was about, and if we did not learn from her life and from what happened to her. One of the great challenges that we face each generation <clears throat> is uh, how to communicate with the next one, and in particular, how to pass on to the generation that follows us those teachings which we have accumulated in our lifetime, as well as those teachings which we have reserved, received from previous generations. In the uh, graphic novel that has been prepared by uh, David and Madison, that concern is reduced significantly insofar as Helen Betty Osborne is concerned because they have accomplished a great deal in the, the small size volume that they have prepared because it is filled with everything that we need to know about those circumstances of her life, both good and bad. It is a novel that has not shied away from the difficult things that have occurred. And at the same time, it is a novel which talks about the inspiration that she brings to us. Those of you who come behind us now and generations that follow, we know that uh, communicating with you has uh, got to occur in a different way than things have in the past. Uh, we have uh, an oral culture. But now, as our culture develops, we recognize that we have to develop different ways of communicating with you. And so uh, I want to congratulate uh, David and Madison for a significant accomplishment, for a great piece of work that they have done here. It uh, complements as well the, the work that uh, we did in the course of the AJI and reporting upon the circumstances as we discovered it. But <clears throat> I do have to admit that as a judge, I write as a judge. I don't write like normal people. And we don't write to entertain. Uh, this book is both entertaining and informative. It helps people to grasp the significance of the events of the day. But in addition to that, it communicates well with young people who are coming behind us, because this is one of the ways now that they understand. <clears throat> 